Let me give you some game, man. First of all, welcome to this channel. It's your boy, Kevin Barnes. Like, share, subscribe. Understand this, man, that if you've worked on something or you're working on something, whether that's a business, you know, whether that's music, whether that's, you know, you're an artist, whether you're a carpenter, whatever it is, right? A lot of people start things but don't complete things for a few reasons. And one thing that you must understand is all work works. All work. If you're putting in five minutes every day towards your dream, you are better off putting in that five minutes than the person that puts zero minutes in there on their dream. But here's the thing. All work works, but it works over time. It takes time for things to work. Now, here it is, right? If it's hard, it's supposed to be hard. It's supposed to be hard until you get better. Right. One thing you cannot escape, you cannot escape becoming the best version of yourself. You can't escape that. You can think you can escape it, but all it's going to yield is unhappiness for you. All work works. All work works, but it works over time. And see, the reason I'm about to give you some real game right now, right? The reason you started things and it's, you know, you you've done it for a little bit, a week, two weeks, a month. The reason you've stopped and quit is because because it got hard. But why did it get hard? Because it was working on you. You see, and that's the thing, you know, anytime you start anything, it's supposed to do two things. It's supposed to work on you until it works for you. And see, sometimes the process of it working on you is too hard. It's too hard. Let, let me just tell you, just, just to keep it real. If, if you're serious about getting to the next level of anything, you're going to cry. If you're serious about getting to the next level of anything, it's going to frustrate you. You are going to quit or want to quit. You're going to want to because that's a part of it. But here's the thing. The people that stayed a long haul are the people that went through that. The people that went through that. Look, I have a group right now where I teach producers how to put their music on TV. And a lot of producers come to me and the first thing they say is, man, how can I quit my job in a week? Bro, like you can quit your job in an hour if you want, but you gotta suffer the consequences. You see, we gotta stop walking around with a microwave mindset, you know? Because we're so used to a paycheck, because people are so used to getting a two week paycheck, if they try something and it doesn't yield a result in two weeks, in a week, they feel like it doesn't work. And what happens when you quit is you throw all that momentum in the garbage and you think you can go and find or start something easier. Look, nothing you start is easy. Run like hell away from people that say, hey, you can do this and it's gonna be easy. Because even making money online, it takes time to set everything up. It takes time to set everything up. And, so, and, and if you're not willing to, or if you don't have the muscle of allowing things to work on you, then nothing that you do in your life is ever going to work for you. Let me say that again. If you don't have the muscle to stay the course and let things work on you, nothing is ever going to work for you. So what did you learn from this? Understand that all work works. If you're putting, you know, if what you're doing right now is not giving you the money, if it's not giving you the followers, if it's not allowing you to quit your job, you got to understand that it's not your time yet, but all work works. It just works in time. So like, share, subscribe. I just wanted to drop that on you real quick.